Welcome everyone to the 305 Goddess channel. I appreciate all of you for being here. Oh my gods and goddesses. Tune again, subscribing, who in the hot seat. Liking the video, the love in the comment section. Aquarius. Donations, purchases. Let's go in. Hmm. Aries, energy, some fire. 2020. Yeah, the emperor type stuff. Hmm. Leo, coming in. More fire, Virgo. Somebody, you don't want the opportunity. You're not taking the opportunity. Goodness. You're so passionate, but you're not taking the right opportunities. Some of you clear that you need to put down the burden. Okay. And get your wish fulfillment that's coming in. What do we have? Oh, what do we have? <laughs> Queen of Clubs, stay passionate. Speaking of a Leo, say a lot of you are passionate. <clears throat> Third party energy. Okay, so you're not tormented. You're clear that you're just going back into this storm. Okay, let's go in. All this air energy, Aquarius. Hmm. I feel like you don't care about it anymore. Let's see what they're talking about. The death card, they said they want it to end. It's a lot of things need to be reborn. Mm. And it came right on now. It's done. Transformation. It's an opportunity for them to get it in. For their world to take another turn. Aquarius, you're having the hope and the healing coming in. That's you, the star card. You're trying to give some love and balance, third party energy. You feel like you don't have any options, but you got to build and gain, and no negative energy happening. So they just wanted to come to an end. And here you are with the rah-rah. But, but, but. Are you using your imaginations? I don't feel like you have new feelings for no one else. You probably just don't care. That's why you're coming back into the storm with them. Generosity, happiness found in nature and spirituality. You need to gain some. Feel like you leaving that behind. Being drained. You need to go work with the options, not look for nothing else in them. The chariot going forward. So yeah, um, they want to end it and you not going forward. So I see them having a brighter opportunity coming in, and you have some love and temperance. Which is another opportunity to learn how to balance and moderation. Okay, so here we are. Being very passionate. See, y'all was probably fucking a lot. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, the star card Aquarius won't disappear. Giving yourself to who and for what? <clears throat> mm, okay. So, here we are. Ten of Wands. Carrying this burden. And then we have Ten of Chalices, but you're not happy. Ten of Wands to the ch Ten of Chalices, so why are you there? At least why are they there, right? <laughs> So someone carrying this burden but not being happy to do it. This is not a happy ending. This is not the end of it. This was a part of it. So here we are. Eight of Chalice is moving right along out of that energy. You see the love that was there. And now, thank you for giving it to me. I'm moving with my love. That all I have left. Six of spades into the storm that I need to be going to. So some of y'all need to move from the past with... Um, putting these burden downs, I told you. you Got to put the burden down and you clear that. Fight for what you truly want, what you truly need. Ace of chalices. Some true love. Move out of the storm and show some true love. Move from the past. No longer doing those things. Queen of Pentacles. And gain in a different perspective. Step up in a different perspective. Start... It working like if you was off of work for a while you go back fresh brand new start i'm not arguing with no one i want to talk to no one i'm going straight in to get my work done focused and i'm leaving at the end of the day like a whole different perspective when you go into things okay queen of wands stay passionate and do so queen of pentacles to the queen of wands that's how you're going to build your foundation and going to be more passionate because it's like you're not doing too much not being so extra don't get yourself caught up with your soulmates. So I do see in a situation where, you know, someone took the opportunity because they liked it. It's a true soulmate. But, you know, we work well together and we, we have occasional sex. But, you know, this is not it. We're not happy. So it's time to move along. Eight of Wands. A lot of communication coming in. Maybe feeling like it needs to be talked about. But I do see a wheel of fortune coming right behind that. A whole new another karma step into it. Go so you can get your money's worth, honey. Two of chalices, put that down. You know how much love is there. You no longer love them. Or they no longer love you. Ace of Wands and end up not wanting to fuck with you no more. Reverse. I'd rather not. Right? So you don't want to do them no more, right? And Three of Swords, now it's heartbreaking because of what you have went through, what you gave away. That's why you have to watch yourself be celibate until you get your one passion opportunity, your twin flame. And here we are. Be independent. Like I said, self-servant. They want to take your goodies and you need to keep them. Self-independent. You're giving out too much of yourself. Too much fire, not enough money. Not enough opportunity. Metatron building all the way to the top. Is that where you're headed? Because he's calling you. And if you give, 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 how could you be building, stacking your way to the top and sitting up there real pretty? Door to value. Value yourself. Goddess of the moon. Up there in the air, Aquarius. Channel your moon side, your shadow side, the shit that you don't need to be doing, that you don't really want. Figure out why you don't want it, why you don't like it, and so you can move beyond it. Teach someone else. You will have children one day, right? Even if not other people. Lust. Stop lusting, right? Twin flames. Wait for your twin flame. I mentioned that. Less than your soulmates. You need your twin flame. Fire signs. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. 
Earth. Come on down to Earth. Virgo. Taurus. Capricorn. Go get your money. Stop lusting. That's why they try to tell you it costs to be the boss. Honestly. Be honest with yourself. Value yourself. Communication. What type do you have? It's all about M-O-E. Newness. You better plan on doing something. Start doing something. Make it a foundation so you can go forward with it. With these energies. How are people going to perceive you? How are you going to treat yourself so people can be like, okay, you know, I fucked with it. Enlightenment. They respect you. Positivity. Stay positive. And stay healthy. Okay. Love you, babies. Can't wait to see you next time here on the 305 Goddess Channel. Check, check.